position. Second down and eight. Hand off. Oh, no. Flay fake. And he's got Darvin Adams deep. He's got him at the 20. Tackle made at the 14. I told you, it's a different Cam Newton. And Auburn does not want to get off on a slow start. One fake, two fakes, and finally the deep ball. And I'll tell you, South Carolina was thinking, run all the way. He beats Stephen Gilmore, their best cover guy. And the receiver, Darvin Adams, they call smooth. Made a smooth play on the deep ball. Offensive line for Auburn. Newton, left side. Yeah, he's got control, can he? Darvin Adams. Each quarterback has thrown four passes in the game, and they've completed four passes. Now, after Auburn makes the first down, they're hurry up. They're coming at you, too. Third down, 10. Quindarius Carr, play fake to him. Pressure, they touch Newton again. Fires it, first down. Darvin Adams. And I'll tell you that South Carolina defensive line is sucking for air right now. Darvin Adams starts on the left side. Cam buys the time. Should not be open, should not be open. But when you face defense out there, they have not gone to their nickel or dime package. One of the things they said the reason why Burn is, remember, if Auburn makes it, they're stuck with the dime package on first down. All out blitz. Good protection. Darvin Adams wide open. He'll stroll in for the score. Okay. That's Stephon Gilmore. He was looking at the back of the jersey of Darvin Adams. And Cam Newton is thrown for two. They call him smooth, and he runs a hitch and go. It's third and seven. If you're a corner, you're thinking, remember, this guy's going to go to the first down line and try to get a first down. He didn't. He went to the first down line and then went a goal. Here comes the yes. He did not throw at all during the timeout. It can't be bothering him. He didn't warm up at all. And Steve Spurrier punted for this third and long. They have to stop him here. Let me just clarify the way I ended that last statement. I said, as of now. There's no indication that uh, a different kind of ruling is going to come down. Here's at what a throw. Now. What a throw. Very complex. Here's Darvin. That's Eric Smith's fourth catch of the season. So uh, Newton finding a little bit of everything in the bag. Deep left. Oh, that's a second drop for Darvin Adams. He had a 62-yard catch to open the first series for Cam Newton at Auburn. I will say this. At this stage of his career, he is a superior passer to Michael Vick. And they bring just three. Newton, play fake. Fires it. Caught! 15 yard line. This time, Norvin Adams hangs on. 15 yard gain. Starvin Adams, yeah, he was the leading receiver last year. He's the leading receiver this year. He was the Outback MVP, and he's had a couple of key drops in this game. But I'm Big Ben, they line up to the right side. There she goes. Tussle tip. Darvin Adams, touchdown on the Hail Mary. I think it was 
was Devontae Holliman, number 21, who tipped it. It was. And then the guy who had two drops earlier in the game snapped it. That short pass gave them just enough yards to do this play. Let's go down to Tracy, who is with Steve Spurrier. Within seven, and then you give up the Hail Mary. Yeah, yeah, we, we look pretty stupid on that last play, but sometimes that happens. Uh, we're only two down. Uh, we, think we get the ball back, so we just got to keep, keep grinding out. How about that final offensive drive for you, though? What worked there to pull within seven? Oh, we just had to catch Marcus one on one for linebacker. But we need to play a lot better offensively and defensively. Thanks a lot. All right. The Hail Mary at the end of the half. Taken by Darvin Adams. That's the end of the first half with the score 28-14. We'll be back with the Dr. Pepper tuition throw after this message from your local station. Bannon got it. Chizik tried to get away. They held him down and, and they got Trooper Taylor. <laughs> hey. Oh, goodness.